Hi friends, I am Apurbo. I am a web developer. Today I will discuss how to convert Linda offline video to MP4. If you have premium access, then you can download Linda video offline. One thing I want to share with you that this video is only for Windows user. Generally, what people do, they try to download all the video with the help of IDM one by one, which is which is time consuming because if you download all the video with Linda offline software, then you are not able to run them without that Linda software and you can't keep it safe for further use. So I will discuss a easy way to convert Linda offline video to MP4. So now you can download all the video at a time and you can keep them safe. Let's start. First step, log in into your Linda account. I have already logged in. Then select the course you want to download. I have already selected the course I want to download. Then go to offline tab and download the app from this link or you can download it from this link. This link has been given in video description. I will recommend you to download the app from this link, not this link because I have tried to download the app from App Store but I was unable to do that. You can download if you want. After downloading the app, you, know, you should log in into your app. I have already logged in into my app also. Now click the download icon of your selected course to download the video course offline. When you click the download icon uh, of the course uh, offline, the course will be down. The download will be started soon. Second step: after completing download, what you have to do? Download a zip file. You can download it from this link by clicking here. This link will be given in video description. Then go to that folder. Uh, then finally, after uh, after downloading the zip file, go to that zip folder and unzip the file. And open Command Promote from Windows Run. Type CMD and click enter. Now copy the URL from here. Go to CMD again. Type CD space. Then from using mouse right button, paste the link here. Click enter. Now we are uh, here is the final step to the, uh, convert the video to offline. Let's start our final step. See this line very carefully. First, you have to type Linda decrypt, then has a space type and slash D has another space. Then go to your Linda offline software. From this icon option, you can uh, see the URL where is your offline video. Uh, you can see the location if, of your offline video. Uh, I can see the offline video is here. Let's visit the folder. Generally, you have to go see user, username, then app data, local, linda.com, linda desktop app, offline, and this is the folder where is all the course, offline course will be here. I have, all, I have downloaded only one course, so here is only one course you can see there. Go to this folder and after that download the uh, copy this URL from here carefully. Don't uh, 
copy space like this or copy it only text copy the only text then go go to the notepad again paste the url very carefully like this after that you have to go back to your offline folder here is your, uh, you can see the offline folder now copy this link url from here again and paste it here make sure that underscore db and after and before space is intact then copy this line without the slash and db.sqlite and paste it sorry i have paste with the semicolon so you have to make sure that you haven't uh, replaced the semicolon with a space i am doing it again so you can see this uh, semicolon is here and uh, here then i have paste the link and here is the db sqlite actually what i am doing first i have copied the uh, course folder with the number then i have copied the url of db sqlite folder after that you have to uh, paste the uh, paste the output folder here uh, your output folder url here i am creating a folder here within offline folder called ap4 you can do it where you want then go to the mp4 folder and copy the url just like before and paste it here now you have done your final step finally the url will look like this one if everything is okay copy this line and paste it in cmd and click enter you can see video converting has been started fine after converting uh, after finishing the converting then you can see a line press any key to exit the program now go to the folder output folder uh, which is mp4 for me and here is my uh, course and you can see all the video is mp4 uh, and i can run there easily hello welcome to learning full stack job okay Finally, we have successfully converted our linear video to MP4. Hope this one help you. If you have any problem, let me know. I will try my best to help you.